the main things with One Love is that we want to be shoulder to shoulder with soldiers for God's kingdom. So we put on here, what's One Love? And we're praying that people will really ask that question. And we believe that question can change someone's life and eternity when they really think about what One Love really is. And as we want to be shoulder to shoulder with soldiers for God's kingdom, we want to help people be obedient to what God's called them to do. And this is Brody. Everybody say, hey, Brody. Hey, Brody. Hey, Brody. Hey, Brody. Awesome. And y'all have skated with Brody. He's been around since the beginning of One Love here at Hope Community Church. And God's done a really cool work in his life. And also, he told me that God was calling him to speak tonight and share with you guys a message. So... I'm going to pray for him, and then I want you to give a warm welcome to Brody, okay? Let's pray. God, thank you for everyone that you've brought here. Um, we thank you for the privilege of skating. Thank you for miraculously providing ramps for us last October 15th. And I thank you so much for Brody. I thank you that you're going to speak through him tonight, and I pray that each one of us would hear from you through Brody's mouth tonight. Thank you for Radiate. I pray we can know your light and be your light and really know your love and be your love so that others can experience your love and live your love, Jesus. Bless Brody now as he speaks. Let your Holy Spirit speak through him and let your Holy Spirit help us hear and obey what you say. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, give it up for Brody. Yay! Oh yeah, I'm Brody. Um, I'm going to start off giving you a little background on what... What all Jesus has done in my life and stuff. So, it all started when it was, I was about 12. And, well, I was really depressed kid. I didn't have any friends or anything like that. All I, thought, all I could ever think about was, like, killing myself. And, not, I guess it's about a year later. Some friends invited me to church. Started going down, and not long after that, we went to this camp and found Jesus there. And after that, my life changed completely. I never thought about killing myself again. I finally felt all right after that. So what I'm wanting to talk about today is Romans chapter 8, verse 1. This says, There is therefore no combination for those who are in Christ Jesus. And the therefore is that we all sin. We all struggle with that. And there's really, there's only one person that can look at us when we are dead in our sin and say that we're clean and pull us out of that death. And his name is Jesus, of course. He's the only one that can do this. There's, there's no one else that can. There's nothing in this world that can bring the satisfaction that Jesus can to your soul. I mean, there's nothing else that can save you from that death. I mean, Jesus is like the only one. <laughs> it doesn't matter how good of a person you are still. If you don't know Jesus, then you're dead. Jesus is the only way to live. All we have to do is accept him. And it's really that easy. I remember, it wasn't all that long ago, but there was a half moon out. I kind of related myself to that because I felt like half empty. And I felt like I didn't have no direction and stuff like that. But then when I realized I need to start following Jesus more, that's when I finally felt complete and it's the greatest feeling ever. So if there's any of you that want to know more about Jesus, you can talk to Josh, me, and my dad, where he was right there. Um, that's 
Really, I'll have to say it again tomorrow. Yeah. All right, that is awesome. And again, that verse Brody shared, y'all have Radiate every Wednesday at 6.30. And Radiate is from Romans 8. You guys know that? Yeah, Romans 8. And so Romans 8, verse 1, says there is no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. And I'd like you to think about that tonight. Do you know the one love of Jesus? <laughs> Are you in Christ Jesus tonight? And that's an opportunity he's extending to you. His hand is reaching down, and you can receive him as your Savior. So you have that opportunity. Talk to Brody. Um, talk to one of us tonight if God's leading you to make that decision to follow him. All right? And as you're skating, encourage Brody. Uh, if something jumped out at you tonight, what he was sharing. But let's celebrate the one love of Jesus tonight. And... Uh, we're also going to do a raffle for that piece of grip tape. The same guy, Simple, who did this, um, did that piece of grip tape. And so in about 45 minutes, um, if you put your name in, we're going to raffle off that grip. All right. So have a blast skating. Give it up one more time. Woo!